guys, it's the Apple Crew here, and today we're gonna try to make a paper iPhone 6 and 6 Plus. I already made the 6 because I think it would take too long to do all of that, so I'll show it to you. There's the 6. So the back plate is just like that, and we're working on the 6 Plus, so all you need is just a blank sheet of paper, and just do that. So what I have done so far, and what I'm working on, I'm just going to get this piece and glue it on the bottom so whenever I put the camera in place, it won't bleed through to the front. Uh, so yeah, here's the six. I'll give you a little, there's the camera, there's the front facing camera, and there's all of that, and there's the home button. So we're going to get this done. I'm just going to go ahead and see if this will fit. I'm not sure. Yeah, that, that, will, that will do. I'm going to rip that little piece off because I don't want it going too far up. Um, I did it off of a calculator, so that's how big it should be. Oh, yeah, and go check out my MacBook Pro. I'll make a video on it. It's a paper one. I'll show you. There you go. Um, I like making paper stuff because I like to be artistic and creative. That's why I play Minecraft all the time. And I will be doing more videos of that, by the way. I will. Okay, let's, um, so as you can see, I glued it on like that at the bottom and the top. So you need to make it exactly like this. This is probably 5.5 inches. Probably is, I'm not sure. So what you wanna do next is pick up your marker. Um, and well, you need to put your lid back on your glue if you haven't already. I have scissors over here, just in case I need the There's paper everywhere. So you want to take your um, pen, pencil. I used my old one, but it ran out. Uh, so and just um, take your iPhone. Wait, hold on. Let me adjust the camera real quick. I'll be right back, guys. Okay, that should be good. Uh, so yeah, we have iPhone 6, you can see there. Okay, whenever you have your 6 Plus, go ahead and take it and make sure you have it on the top. And then go ahead and put your camera in there. Now, what you wanna do is you wanna take your marker, and I'll sit back over there in a second. Take your marker and make a little spot. Right, hold on, I'll put it up to the camera in just a second. You wanna have a little dot like that. That's what you want it, want it to look like. So whenever you have that finished, get, let's go back to the display. Um, what you want to do, if you want to make the screen unlock, uh, so here's what you're gonna do. What you're gonna do, you're gonna make an arrow, like that. Just make an arrow, like that, across your screen. Then you're gonna put slide. Okay, just put slide right there. And then just put the time, it's 6.15 here. So just go ahead and put the time up there if you want, right there. And it is PM, so you can put a little PM. PM right there, so there's the time. Uh, so you can just slide the unlock, and you can just use that. Um, I'm going to make a whole bunch more stuff like this. I'm going to make a little charging area on the back, because I want to like that. So there is what your iPhone should look like so far. Now, whenever you flip back over to the back, I'm not a really good Apple drawer. So yeah, this is a fake iPhone. It doesn't have to be the Apple, it could be anything. It could be an Android if you, if you wanted it to be. I'm gonna try to do my best on an Apple. Okay, um, doesn't look like an Apple, but whatever. I don't care. So, whenever you have that, just go ahead and Basically all you need to do 
And then what it may bleed through a little bit, but that's okay because later on it'll just fade back. So what you need to do now, you take your iPhone and on the back you want to put iPhone at the bottom. iPhone 6 Plus. And this will be the 128 gigabyte. 28. Okay, so there you go. And that, and you can see that did not bleed through at all. So, there you go. Let's give you a closer look there, guys. See that didn't, oh. See that didn't bleed through at all. So, whenever you get back, what you're going to do next is basically, you're going to draw something on the display because, of course, you have that little fading through thing. Where we drew the apple on the back. Now you do not have to do this, but I suggest you do this or else you'll just have something on your screen like that. Now, what you're going to draw right there is like a background. I'm probably going to do Minecraft. So what you're going to do is you're going to put, pick up your pen. Now this is how I'm going to draw it. What you're going to do, you're going to draw a little box. I'm not a little box, but here. I'll just draw what I want here. T. So, whenever you have what you want there, to make it into a background, all you have to do is just add a little bit of tinted color or something like that. So, whenever you have your wording down, in the background, just make it like Minecraft or whatever you want to do. I'm going to make uh, a creeper face. Okay, that's horrible. Let's just draw a block here and another block here. That. And then a block here. Here, you'll see what I'm talking about in just a second. Okay, so whenever you have that filled in, like that, I mean, you don't have to do Minecraft, but that's what I'm doing. So, whenever you have that, just underline it, the word. So, there you have your iPhone all ready to go just like that. Now, if you followed those steps, you should have the iPhone 6 Plus paper version, uh, something fell on my regular iPhone 6 fell on the floor. So there you go guys, um, not done yet. See how long this video is, it's eight minutes, that's okay. Um. Now, if you did make the six, uh, good. So I'm gonna go ahead and do something to my six on the camera. Okay. Okay, made the, oh, that's way too big for the camera, but if you made it way too big like that, that's okay. So then what you want to do, you wanna come to the back and draw your apple. You're going to draw this with a light pen, like this for instance, you're going to draw an apple on the back. Now I'm not the best drawer in the world as you guys saw earlier, so all I did was just this. It's not really much at all, to be honest. But it's something, so what you're gonna do next is make your slide to unlock on your iPhone. Now, as you can see, this is, uh, the iPhone will be a little bit, the iPhone 6 will be a little different because it doesn't have that big screen. So what you're gonna have to do is basically do the exact same thing with the arrow. Right slide to unlock right there. Then what you want to, hold on, let me make sure you guys can see that, yep. Uh, what you're going to do next is make your background. Of course, I made it the iPhone 6, which is not going to be that really easy. So I'm going to try to do it. 
Oh, let's see here. I'm gonna try to make a case for this too if I can out of paper. Oh, uh, let's see here. So, okay, if you want your background to be an iPhone 6, uh, just draw a mini one. Just draw a mini phone or something like that. A little bit like that, and just make another iPhone 6. Like that, like that, like that, and like that, and like that. So just make something like that if you chose iPhone 6 for that. Uh, let me just give you guys a closer look on the back. That looks good. Uh, I'll make the iPhone 4, I'll make the iPhone 5, I mean, the, the 5S, uh, the 4, the 4S, the 3, the 3GS, the 2, and yeah. So here is the iPhone 6, what you should have the result of right there. See how long this video is, it's 11 minutes. I'm just gonna go ahead and set back here and show you guys both the devices. Not really devices because they're made out of paper, but still. So here it is. Here's the iPhone 6 Plus, which is, has the Minecraft theme. Here's the iPhone 6, which has its own theme. So there they are, size comparison. Give you a little bit of the back. I did better on the 6 Plus. Oh yeah, and you need to draw that little iPhone. I'll be back when I get done with that. Okay, guys, I'm done with that iPhone 128 gigabytes. Uh, so yeah, there is your iPhone and what it should look like whenever you are done with it. So yeah, I'll be right back with a real iPhone 6 and show you the size comparison. Okay, guys, I am back with an iPhone 6 here and I can't wait to see it here and nope, <laughs> I made it way too small. <laughs> Let's see the lock screens. Oh, uh, yep, I tried to call it. I had to call it. Uh, so, <laughs> yep, that, that back, I have a case on this, by the way. I'll do a review on this, too. <laughs> so, let's compare it to the 6 Plus. Um, are they the same size? Wow. The 6 Plus isn't even the size. But yeah, it's bigger. Yep. That is awesome. Wow. I'm actually kind of proud of myself for doing this. Well, guys, I hope you enjoyed this video. So.